So here we are on our first stop of our summer trip. And we're all set in here. Here's our hookups. Um, right here's our hookup. Thing about this place, come here, spot, fire ants. Thing about this place, it's only 15 bucks a night if you want to hook up. If you want to come in and boondock, it's free. There is a lot of fire ants, though. Over oh, here's a fire ant hill. You step on that baby, you'll be sore for a long time. You gotta keep spot out of them. And, uh, we got the trailer all set up. There's plenty of cell phone service here, so I don't have to put out my extra antenna. Got my wires running up electric wires or cords I should say got my new pickup there got the AC uncovered so I can use it for a heater tonight it's already pretty cool out here and uh, walk around a little bit my new pickup it's got the Godzilla engine which if you don't know what that is it's the biggest V8 made in America right now. It's huge. 430 horsepower. And you'll notice there's a bunch of poop by my truck. There's a bunch of poop everywhere because the guy has a bunch of horses and he got a bunch of uh, donkeys. So I have to be careful with Spot. For those people that don't know it, donkeys will kill any kind of canine. Just one of them can do it. And uh, I don't know why it is they hate canines so much, but they'll kick them to death. And so the guy warns everybody when, he co when you come in here to uh, keep your dogs away from the donkeys because the donkeys will go after them and kill them. And they know his dog, so they don't bother him. There's one other person here, at least the RV. It's supposed to be more showing up today. And uh, you see more hookups. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. But for 15 bucks for the night, and it's on the road, I was traveling up anyway. So what the heck? And here you got you some nice, nice outdoor cooking utensils. And uh, take a look around here. I had to keep my eyes. The donkeys are over there. I don't know if you can see them in this video, but they're over there. I got to make sure they don't come bolting over here, kill my dog. You can see me rustling a donkey down to the ground. I could probably take two or three of them down at once, but I don't know if I could take the whole pack of them. And Spot's not on sniffing all the poop around. A lot of poop. There was just a lot of heavy rain here, so there's a lot of ruts. Got a woods back there. Some kind of building. Let's see. Got the gate over there where the donkeys come in and out. And uh, yeah, I got to keep an eye on them. And over here's uh, some more stuff. It's not a bad place. Don't get me wrong. He's got all kinds of hookups. If he fills up in here, he's making some serious money. And uh, I'm sure it's all not regulated. It's in Georgia. It's right south of uh, Homerville on 441. And it's this new, I don't know if you want to call it a club or organization or whatever. It, you join it for 50 bucks a year and they list all these places you can stay for free across the United States. And there's a bunch of them. I'll put the link down in the description anybody interested that has an RV and wants to do some boondocking. And uh, it's a wide variety of places. Some of them are uh, houses with just a driveway. Some are farms. Some are 
an acre where they allow you. But most of them are boondocking, in other words, no hookups. But a lot of them will sell you electric or something for five dollars or ten dollars, which is reasonable. That's all I need is electric. I can actually do without it with my rig, but it makes it easier to have electric. Then I don't have to run the TV off the battery and and uh I think this is where they put the people bounce a check. I'm not real sure, but that could be what this hole was for. But, um, so I pay cash. I don't take the chance. And I'm going to show you the gate you come in to get here. Oh, he's even got a dump station. Check that out. For you that don't know what a dump station is, that's if, uh, you're doing a lot of boondocking and your tanks get full in your RV, you can just pull up here hook your pipe to the dump station and empty it. That way you don't have to actually rent a, a spot or something in a different RV park. So we got a dump station here. <laughs> it's, a, it's a drum in the ground. That's funny. I guess he has a field somewhere to let it drain, but whatever. And you got some fresh donkey poop. They were all out here around the gate, so I couldn't get in. I had to call the guy to come let me in because the donkeys were hanging out at the gate. So here's the gate you come in. And uh, nothing but the tightest security here, trust me. So anyway, I just wanted to do a little quick video. There's a pond over there. I don't know if you can see it. There's a pond way over there, and I'll try to zoom in on it. And it's a looks like a a ladder or something going down into it. I'm sure it's good clean water. But anyway, for 15 bucks a night, and it's right around where I wanted to stop anyway on the trip. It's 300 miles from where I left this morning, so that's about perfect. I only like to do 300 miles a day. And getting too old to and I'm not in no hurry. I'm no hurry. So All right, that's it for this video Y'all take care and I'll put up and I was going to show you my awning But it's too much poop and stuff around so I'm not going to put it up today So I'll wait till the next place I get to it's a little better, but I'll show you how my awning goes up and how it works And I'll be keep making videos so keep checking back to my channel and subscribe so I can quit beating spot. And y'all take care. Bye.